Hey folks, uh, just wanted to pop in to let you guys know that I'm, that I'm very thankful for all the subscriptions and your friendships and everything else, and for those that have stood up to defend me when I'm being shot down in a in a friggin' ball of flame by other people that decide that I'm apparently uh, putting them down uh, for Halloween. But anyways, I love Halloween. And uh, the only thing I don't like anymore is the trick-or-treat part where you have them visiting your house. Uh, I don't carry candy, uh, unfortunately. Well, no, I shouldn't say unfortunately. I used to be a big candy freak. In fact, I used to weigh 260, 280 pounds. I'm now 205. Um, after managing my weight for about a year, uh, basically I'm keeping myself busy. But most of the stuff I used to eat was because I was bored and uh, or repressing my emotions so uh, on another note with uh, Halloween well uh, the fun of it is dressing up but I'm not dressing up this year I'm taking it off relaxing and enjoying other people dressing up I hope you'll have fun safe fun if you go to any Halloween parties uh, don't over drink uh, don't do anything in too much excess because you'll regret it the next morning or the day after. I know it's part of the fun factor, but the last thing that you need is to feel sick, uh, not be able to perform your job, put other people at risk, put yourself at risk. Uh, and even better yet, if you do insist on drinking, make sure you have a designated driver. <laughs> um, I've just discovered something I hate about YouTube. Uh, not all the not all the videos do this, but there is at least two I've encountered so far. I, I haven't marked them down. Um, but what's the what's the, the importance of commercials? I mean, yes, commercials do sell things, but do we need to have it force-fed to be able to watch a vid? I mean, nowadays with things the, the way they are, it should be a, an optional choice and left up to the person, at least popping down, popping sideways, popping, and then we can just take it off and end of story. But with DVDs, that, uh, well, I don't know how it is with Blu-ray, hope to God somebody was intelligent and say, well, they're paying enough for the, the DVDs, let's give them a choice about fast-forwarding past the commercials. Um, if there's one thing I can't stand is when they don't put in any options and they force the pathways for us to be able to get to the movie or get to what we want to do, what to see, etc. Uh, through a bloody commercial. That's a big pet peeve for me and it's even worse when it's a commercial that I don't want to see. I don't mind humorous commercials, but it's something that's bland, something that... Uh, trying to think what it is but uh, I'm sorry it's just a frustration for me on a good note one commercial I do love and you guys can tell me what you enjoy as commercials uh, me it's the A&W with uh, the for the lack of the name of the manager <laughs> the, the slightly rotund manager and the thin geeky guy um, they've been together for quite a long time in these A&W commercials. I don't know if you guys have a and W. If you live outside of Canada, probably not. It is a, a Canadian franchise at the very least, I think. And I, I apologize in advance if I actually uh, overstepped my bounds in regards to the information for that. But uh, the last commercial that they've invented, it's for the Sorloin uh, Twins. It's too small... Uh, too small, well, too small, about like yay big. The size of a McDonald's hamburger, I think, is probably what they're made of. Either that or the, 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 the no, actually, I'd probably say they're probably the size of a regular hamburger. But uh, the sirloin is actually quite thick, and it's just that he, the manager is asking the, uh, the, his geeky employee, uh, do you think they'll sell? Do you think they, they'd be too cute that people wouldn't need them? Well, I'm sorry, but if I actually walk into a fast food franchise, it's because I have a hankering for something, not to collect edible art and to put it under glass. God forbid. That's a waste of food. But 
hey, I, you have to credit them for the actual way that they did it. It's actually fun. They they put some emphasis on some of the, the stuff. But please, guys, share, tell me, uh, post your video uh, your video responses here, or if you don't want to, then give me just a text response. This is where you guys get a chance to participate. Now, always encourage it, especially because you're uh, part of my YouTube family. Come on, go ahead. You won't regret it. Have a nice one.